Hi Cancer, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot and I'm here to do your reading from now until the end of November. This is for Cancer Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Typically I focus on love. This reading is not a private reading, therefore it does not have your name on it. That means it may be for you, it might not be for you, okay? I always cut the vice versa deck so I can get a starting energy. I only do it with the vice versa deck. I don't know why, it's just this weird thing. So I cut it to the nine of pentacles. It looks like you guys, look at all the work you've done. You've done a lot of work. There's a lot of growth here. There's a lot of abundance, a lot of gratefulness, a lot of inner abundance. It's like you guys have done a lot of hard work. And your hard work is about to pay off. The next, the card before this is the eight of pentacles. That's where you were doing the work. Now, look at where you've come. I mean, the time is ripe. The time is ripe for you to get what you deserve because you put in the effort. The next card is the Ten of Pentacles. That's extreme abundance. You are so close. So close. It looks like you've done a lot of work by yourself. This is the independent person. Done it. I've done it on my own. And it wasn't easy, but you persevered. The storm is over. Just about. Okay, the next card is the Ten of Pentacles. You may feel like you're alone, but if you are, you're not going to be alone for much longer because this looks like she's headed towards the end of the road. Okay, she's, she's headed towards um, wish fulfillment. Something's been cooking behind the scenes. The, the moon is hidden forces. The, the universe sees your work. So this is like giving up your independence for some of you. You know, for some of you, you're about to receive some sort of the, oh, the, the, the reward, the next pentacle, the ace of pentacles, the, the, the reward, the golden opportunity is about to be presented to you. That's going to bring you the abundance, the rest. It's going to bring you that completion, the reward. Okay. You're about to get some sort of reward. Now, for some of you, I mean, this is a card of independence. Maybe you decide to go on your own. If you're with somebody, could definitely go that way. For, for a lot of you, you are already single. And you're about to get a golden opportunity. For some of you, you're about to take go on your own. And go, that Ace of Pentacles can be a single, you know. So, yeah, it, it can go either way. What you've been waited, waiting for is coming. The Three of Wands. You've been getting prepared. And getting this time of getting prepared has not gone in vain. Because your ship is about to arrive. The puzzle piece. That's the yin and yang that you've been waiting for. Oh boy. The Ten of Cups. Happiness. Divine partner. I mean, look at them. They're, they're in love. It's easy. Happiness. I mean, happily ever after. One cycle of struggle is just about over. And it's because you have worked so hard on yourself. And that's, that's what it is. There's no more thinking about it. It's about taking that step. The world is in your hands now. Goosebumps are here. The death card, new beginning, transformation, endings bring new beginnings. One phase of your life is over. And it, it is whether you are becoming single or you are no longer going to become single. Whatever it is, either you're going to become single or you're no longer going to be single. This is change, transformation, big, big, big change. It's the ending of a phase. It's the death of life as you knew it. Okay? That's what this is. Rebirth. So yeah, you have a new beginning here, Cancer. And it looks as though this new beginning is going to lead you down a brand new road where you have a, a lot of love. When you get to wherever it is that you're going, it's good. there's going to be a soulmate connection. Woo! Look at, there's you. And these aren't reversals because there's stuff on both sides. So you don't do these in reverse. This is you. 
moving in the right direction towards victory and success, mastering your emotions. You took the lead. You found the inner strength. You persevered. You faced opposition. This is mental strength. It's like you mastered your emotions and now you're coming up on top. You're in control. And things are going to happen pretty quickly. All right? We're just going to go ahead and lay out the rest of the cards. I saw this one before, but I shuffled and it's still here. There has been some deception, hasn't there? Somebody has cheated you in the past and you're scared. You're still scared of that. You are. And I understand. I would be scared too if I've been cheated out of love. You know, you may have been dealing with a cheater or somebody that totally, totally deceived you. I don't know. For some of you that are watching this, this is for hundreds and thousands of people. For some of you that are watching this, you've been cheated on. You have been cheated on and maybe you're deciding that you're going to go on your own because you know what? I don't deserve to be cheated on. I've been robbed. You know, if you know somebody has robbed you of happiness, that's for damn sure. But now you're about to get exactly what you do. The answer to your prayers with these threes, your prayers have been heard. Things are moving in a better direction. We have both the transformation cards here. Your life is about to transform. And your worries are going to float away. No joke. The devil. Luckily, it's, 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 you, would, you could call it reversed, but taking back control. You are in control, not the devil. The demons, the fears, the uh, sabotage. You're now in control. It's like some chains are being broken. Because here, you know, they're chained. Here you can't even you can't even see them. They're gone. The chain the people they're gone. Okay? The chains are being broken. That have kept you back, that have kept you tied down, that have kept you stuck. It's because of your hard work and perseverance. Let me make sure that this is zoomed in good. Pretty good, right? So, it looks as though you, whoever it is that's coming into your life, it's somebody that you have waited for. And it's somebody who's going to appreciate you, respect you, work together with you. It's going to be a two-way street, not a one-way street. It looks as though you're about to step into a new <laughs> I can't even think of the word land you know what I mean it's like you're moving to a whole new place and this could even signify moving no more thinking about it it's time it's time to take that step to face the world, to show the world that what you're made of. <laughs> anyway, your worries, your anxiety are about to go right out that window because you're turning your back on it. Your back is, you're, they're gonna, they are. The stuff, that, the shit that you have been worried about and holding on to is gonna start to dissipate more and more and more. The storm is just about over for you and you're about to have a major new beginning and it's because you have taken back your power in a huge way by working on yourself and persevering and being grateful and learning your lessons, just the whole nine yards. You've worked so hard to go through this transformation. There's been a lot of ups and downs. And you are dealing with somebody that, I mean, he's got five swords in his hand, two down here. Somebody that left you broken. Somebody that uh, overpowered you. Somebody that left you for dead almost. You know, this person totally deceived you. Lied to you with the two of swords. They kept you stuck. 
You may have been even dealing with a narcissist, I'm not sure. You were dealing with somebody who was very, very hurtful and it has held you back from this soulmate connection. You needed to take this time or you need to if you're just getting out of a relationship to go within, heal, work on your self-worth, work on your self-esteem, master your emotions so that you can bring victory and success back to your life. For some of you, you're already there and you're about to rise back up and get what you deserve, which is this happily ever after, after being deceived so badly. Let's get one of these. You have to make a decision. Are you ready for this? Here's your decision. Are you ready for this connection? We have Scorpio, Capricorn, Cancer. That's what we have so far. I'm going to get clarifiers over there in a minute, but I just want to get one of these for Cancer. Action. Action. Now, this person, if you are single, that is coming into your life may not be your usual type. You see, they may not because you see there's opposites and there's opposites here. Um, so they may, you, they may like say, for example, they could be dark and white. So, you know, different skin color or they could be fat and, and skinny. You know what I mean? Just giving you some examples here. This person is, there's going to, there's opposites attract. That's what I'm trying to say. This person that is going to come into your life is, is probably not your usual type but it's time for a change and it looks like you're it you're going to be the one taking action they may be coming after you though as well there's definitely some action happening here where somebody is on the chase I mean, it's like, I'm going after what I want, and I'm going to get it. I'm absolutely going to get it. I'm not. And this person, it's like you can't get away because it's just, it's like a game. It's like the chase is on. It's on. So, yeah, there's there's definitely a, a chase. The chase is on. So, let's get us a couple clarifiers here. We have... Your prayers have been answered. Your prayers have been heard. And you're moving in a new direction. Away from the troubled times that you have been in. You're moving to a more peaceful, serene atmosphere. Time in your life. You are. You're transitioning out of that period of, of deception. You really are. The devil no longer has control over you. That's what I'm trying to say. And you are going to be recognized. You're going to be recognized for all your hard work, for your valor. Whoever's coming into you at 6-6, six, six, they're going to help you to get your life back on track. It's balance. 6 is about balance. It's like I said, it's going to be mutual. I knew it was. Where it's not one-sided. Somebody's going to respect you. They're going to honor you. And wherever you're headed, it leads to victory and success. Victory and success. Victory and... There's good... This is... And there's just going to be a lot of balance and harmony in this relationship. It's, it's, it's beautiful. Yeah, there's been bloodshed. There has been. But you need to hold your head up high and be proud of yourself because you did it. You made it. So yeah, you are definitely headed someplace else. You're, you could be even moving. I'm not sure if you're going to be moving, but you could be moving. Like changing location. Um, definitely could be moving. Yeah, somebody brought... Remember I mentioned the Five of Swords. Somebody brought you down... And they and you stayed down for quite some time, right? But I don't see that happen, happening anymore. I feel as though you're about to stand up for yourself and walk in a new direction. 
So yeah, I think that you have been cheated and the decision has been made to drop it, to break those chains from this person that abused you. And now you're going to receive a new beginning because you deserve it. You worked so freaking hard. Endings bring new beginnings. So Cancer, you have somebody arriving, whether it's now or in December. I It could be now. It could be now that is it's a beautiful connection where there's mutual love you know what I mean it's not one-sided this person is not your usual type they don't fit the image they don't I just know they don't but their heart their heart is genuine Oh my God, stay optimistic about your love life. Positive thinking and faith will bring you romance. Think positive because it's getting you somewhere. It absolutely is. Children, your love life is being affected by children. This could be what has held you back. I don't know. Or this could be what I don't know, you you figure that one out, how that figures in. But it has affected your love life. Children has. It's going over here. You're moving in a new direction. You are. You are moving in a new direction. The storm is over. You've done a lot of work. And if you've been single, you're not going to be single for much longer. If you are coupled, you're probably going to become single. Because there's a big change here. There is. Big change, major change with these with these two cards. And this is a completion. A completion of one phase that leads to happiness. So yeah, we have a completion here, an ending that is going to bring you something that you have been praying for. And when this arrives, it's going to bring balance and harmony. This person that comes in is giving. You won't have to do all the giving. Release your ex. The time has come to clear your energy. Right now. Because you have a partner that can lead you down a new path to happiness. I'm no, no joke. So yeah. That's what I see. Stay optimistic. It's going to happen. Stand up. Keep going. You're headed in the right direction. Don't give up because you're about to have a, a major new beginning with, with this death card. I mean, endings bring new beginnings. So, yeah, I feel like there's been some sort of cheating. There's been some sort of deception here where somebody didn't care about whether they hurt you or not. I mean, this right here, you were dealing with somebody who seriously didn't care. Seriously. They don't care if they hurt you. They don't care if you are on the bottom. They don't care. And it has kept you stuck for long enough. So this is the choice. You have to make a choice. And it looks like the choice has been made. If not, you're about to. The two of, pen, two of wands, that's a choice. There's plenty of fish in the sea. Pick one. Anyhow, you have an opportunity for love here after being totally abused. 
And it looks like now that you are releasing the demons. I mean, this is death is released, the devil. Release the demon. Release the demon. You have this new partnership that is coming into your life that you have been praying for. Stay optimistic. Okay? Stay optimistic. Think positive. Remember, this person is not your usual type. They're different. They look different than you, whether it's their size or it's their color, whatever. They look different, but they're the one. Be optimistic. Good luck.